chapter 838 review. Okay, let's talk about it. Okay, so. One, two, three. One Piece chapter 838 review. Now, to start off the review, I would like to talk about Luffy versus Cracker, which was the majority of the chapter. It was, let's be honest, most of the chapter. Amazing fight. This just proved my point even more, though, that uh, Luffy is not ready to fight Big Mom. He just, he's not. Luffy is not ready to fight Big Mom if he can't even be Cracker. And I, he actually used a new attack on Cracker. It was the Gamu Gamu no organ. And he was like, Gamu Gamu no organ. And he like hit him with it. And it was like, it was like a multiple King Kong guns at once. And Cracker just created those Cracker clones and took it. Now, I do want to talk about Cracker Della Fruit a bit. Cracker Della Fruit, okay. I think it's a little broken, and I think it may be a little too broken. Now, I know what you're thinking. How is it too broken? Well, let me explain. With Doflamingo and with Bond Clay or any other character who cloned themselves or made themselves look like somebody else, not Bond Clay. Bond Clay had the ability to transform into people. Mr. Three. With Mr. Three and Doflamingo, their Della Fruit having cloning ability sort of made sense. So Flamingo was like creating a clone and controlling it like a puppet, and Mr. Three could make a clone out of wax. It's not very realistic, but you could you could make a replica of a person with wax. You could have a pu and you control a puppet with a string. So it made so those make sense. This stuff with Cracker, it just it just doesn't make sense. It really doesn't. It really a lot of stuff you can do like Cracker clone, like biscuit clones. What? Biscuit clones? Why? Why can Cracker make biscuit clones? I don't think that makes sense, and that did kind of bug me. And really, the only thing in the chapter I did not like, that I did not think Madela Fruit made sense. I'm not going to lower the rating of the chapter for it, because One Piece has never made a lot of sense. There are things in One Piece, logically, that just don't make sense. That's just the way the series works. It's not meant to be realistic at all. But that's the size. The point is still kind of bugs me. Now the actual fight between Luffy and Cracker was great. Luffy definitely not ready to fight Big Mom. Cracker cut Luffy. I want to mind telling you guys about that. Cracker cut Luffy in Gear Four. When Doflamingo kicked Luffy in Gear Four, it bounced it back. Cracker was able to cut through Luffy's armament hockey and land a good blow on Gear Four. That is in some impressive crack. Now, later on in the chapter, we will see, um, Brooke and Pedro are actually inside of one of the crackers, I guess, in clone. One of his foot soldiers, one of the cracker soldiers. Brooke and, Brooke and Pedro are inside of there. They want to go meet up with Sanji. They want to go meet up with Sanji. So, yeah, they're going to try to get to Sanji. They're obviously not going to get to him because Sanji is endgame. Like, Sanji, actually, maybe they will get to him. You remember, getting to Robin was Endgame in any lobby originally, but that changed, and they got to Robin. They met up with him. So maybe they'll meet up with Sanji, but he'll end up getting escorted away, or they'll end up getting pushed back, or something. That would be pretty cool. We also see Chopper with, um, with, uh, Carrot, and Chopper and Carrot are kind of chilling in the uh, mirror world. Chopper was guilty that had a plan, so she was so carrot must call him Runner Chopper. So she called him Bropper. Bropper, because Bropper is a combination of Brother and Chopper. I loved that. Great storytelling. Great comedy. Amazing comedy. I loved it. It all did a great thing where uh, Pound and Nami were being surrounded by the homies, and Nami was like, what? And they're like, you know, they're afraid to leave the forest. But then Nani pulls out the Vivri car and he's like, what is scarier? And she's like, gritting this like shadow behind her. And they're all like, Nani's the scariest. And it was, it was just great. I love it because Luffy is Luffy's also afraid of Nami. So I find that funny. They're afraid of the fights between Luffy and Cracker. So they're afraid of Luffy. So they're just afraid of, Na of Nami as Luffy is. They're afraid of Luffy and Cracker fight, and Luffy's afraid of Nami. I, just, I made that connection, and I found that really funny. We got the combination on Ichiji and Niji's name being Ichiji and Niji. Ichiji is called Ichiji 
barking red. So I'm assuming it's power, maybe fire based. Maybe they're like fire based or something like that. Um, Niji is called electric blue. So his Delafruit will, his powered or Delafruit, whatever he has, will probably be um electricity based. So I can't wait to see those next chapter. I think it's a really good chapter. I found it very interesting how if you look at the final page, in the bottom corner, we actually see Sanji like holding his arms and it looks like he dropped his cigarette. That was really good stuff. I really like when you see Sanji, he's like shuddering almost and he's seeing his brothers again. I love that. But um, yeah, I can't think of much else to say. Um, there will probably be a lot like any lobby. Like we may get, we may end up seeing eventually Sanji may try to fight back, but they may start doing the ticking on his handcuffs. But they may have a remote control. They'll hit like bomb, and as it's ticking, he'll be like, "No, I, I thought I'll stop." I know they'll like stop the explosion. That's what I would assume. I mean, maybe, but Sanji's out of commission right now. The power, the way the chat, this is all working out is weird. Luffy is Luffy too weak to be cracker. Sanji can't fight, and Nami doesn't need to fight because the homies are afraid of her. So it's like, I know not sure what, they're, what we're trying to get get to here. But I'm also, I am very excited because I can tell we're probably going to be out of the seducing woods soon. But yeah, uh, they're added by review of One Piece chapter 838. If I had to rate the chapter, I would give it an 8 out of 10. It was a, no, 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10. I'm sorry, it just... But thing with, uh, Cracker, Cracker, Delafruit, and the, and the Seducing Woods. I stick with the Seducing Woods. I, I, I don't talk about it in the review, but you guys know I stick with the Seducing Woods. And Cracker, Delafruit being the way it is. I don't like the way his Delafruit works. It just, it bothers me. Maybe it doesn't bother you, but it does bother me. Tell me your thoughts on the chapter in the comment section down below. And above all else, guys. Have a great day. The One Piece Nation, signing out. Peace.